I think the event is great uh, because it, it focuses people's mind on, on buying Irish, first of all, and but, but also the, the, the quality of our product here in Ireland. Uh, it's an excellent product. I mean, it's great to chat to people, get their reaction to the product uh, and a answer any questions they have uh, because people don't know, just talking about my own industry, don't know uh, a huge amount about craft brewing, so it's it's good to be able to meet them and and, and uh, explain the product to them and how we, and how we how we come up with the product using natural ingredients. I think it's great from a point of view of getting the names of these little Irish craft beers or the Irish craft cheeses out there to people. Like it's still like it's still a very small starting from a very small beginning, uh, and just my just in, between last night and now and this evening. Um, People trying the different stouts and the different ales from all around the country, and uh, they're, you know, the cheese, and they're asking us back, "What cheese is that now? What what ale is that? Or what stout is that?" So it's it's, it's just informing people on what's out there. We've got the little the great Irish craft breweries we have around the country now, and uh, Irish farmhouse cheeses. You know, we have the Galway Hooker Pale Ale from Roscommon, the Dungarvan Brewery, Cast de O'Hara's. Uh, we've the new beer Carrick brewed in Offaly. I, I think it's educating your customers and talking about it and creating something different to talk about in the pub and yeah I think it's reaction to it's been great and I think it's growing all the time I think there's a right mo movement happening at the moment. Cheese is just fantastic to to match up with beer it's just a nice flavour cheese is nice to have in a bar and it can bring back some of the old traditions that you know I mean cheese and crackers or cheese and brown bread in, in, in a bar and now matching it with nice beers from around Ireland Good. but I think the timing is right now people are ready for craft beer supporting their own maybe it's the times we're in as well that people like to support uh, Irish Irish people doing setting up new businesses in the current times. We're really pleased that Board B has organised this beer and cheese tasting. It's, it's, it's a really concerted effort to get Irish products, Irish beers and Irish cheeses in a joint manner. We often do wine and cheese pairings and we do food and cheese pairings. But it's great to actually have the product range in terms of Irish artisan handmade beers and also obviously Irish artisan cheeses which I think have been recognised for a long time. But taking those two things and then pairing them together. So it's a really exciting event for us and it's a, a really genuine concerted way to be able to, to promote Irish products. But in terms of being able to match the two items, the beers and the cheeses, and be able to present them to the public here in Donnybrook Fair and all of the customers, who, by the way, you know, don't necessarily realise the kind of product range of craft beers that exist. I think certainly I, I'm, I'm a cheesemonger. I'm obviously very familiar with cheese and, and I do a lot of tastings and people are aware to a large extent of the kind of Irish cheese that's available. Um, but I think they had no idea really the range of Irish craft beers. It was really new and exciting. And, um, and I think they're all quite excited now that they can go off and buy all of these Irish handmade beers. I think people like to meet, I mean, for example, obviously I don't make cheese, but I think people, you know, when, when I'm speaking to them, I can tell them about Marion Rolevelt that makes Galeen cheese. I can tell them about Eamon who makes Nakanor. I can tell them about Mary Burns that makes Ardrahan. And these are all people that I consider to be my friends, these cheese makers, and certainly who work very closely with us in Sheridan's and with Donnybrook Fair. So I think people really enjoy that link. And they enjoy learning more about this produce because at the end of the day you know buying these cheeses and also these beers and the dirt and garden brewing company people are great and eight degrees and and um, carlo brewing company but you know what it's about the story a lot of this is about the story when, when i sell products to people when i speak about products to people i i think that half of what they buy is a story they want to know about where their food came from and they want to know that it's irish they want to know that their beer is irish and when they have that story and when they can engage with me or, or with the members here at Donnybrook Fair about that story and the Irish story, it makes all the difference to what they buy. Irish customers are very conscious of, of Irish products these days and very aware of, of, uh, of, of buying Irish products and there seems to be a huge increase in people being interested in what's out there and what's available and, uh, and wanting to get that into the store. Well, it showcases not only what we're doing but what our producers are doing, whether they're the brewers or the cheese manufacturers. Um, so it, it brings, the, brings the population in, shows them a little bit about what we're doing. It's supporting local Irish jobs, it's supporting private business owners, not just the big multinationals. And I think customers, particularly in the sort of modern climate, are looking for that kind of traceability. When, it's, when we started off, there was a very, maybe one, two bars would have done gastropub, um, doing different beers. Now, it's very strange, even walking into what I call old men's bars and seeing a Galway hooker there, 
or a trouble or it would never have been happening before. I see bottles I would never see in any bar. Being in there, um, it's not just us that's doing it. It's actually starting to grow everywhere now because a lot of people are looking for this new product. I think they're just bored of the usual thing they've been given and been drinking for so long that they have this new, fresh kind of, oh, it's Irish, it's fresh, it's good. Yeah, it's working. And it actually tastes pretty good as well.